Palum's tale. Palum, the black mage, has sworn to follow in the late Tella's footsteps and become a sage. His elder sends him to Troya to train Lea. Oh, what? I'm trying to pop up. Uh, Leonora, an apprentice epopped in black magic. What does a peaceful kingdom need such powerful magic for? The upheavals rocking the entire world are about to land on Troya's doorstep. Get another new game plus game going. Two for this random achievement to just unlock randomly. On board. They just ain't biting captain. Stop your whining. Look, hey, Captain, how much longer do we have to keep putting up with that brat? Uh, which brat would that be? Enter Palum. <laughs> he definitely looks different. Definitely not as uh, ratty, but I guess he's still arrogant. I, I apologize for my cruise insolence, Lord Palum. Lord. You know, you're at least several decades older than me. Did you forget? In in that case, what would you like me to call you? Forget out for yourself, why don't you? You're a grown man, right? Er, yes. So quit bowing or bowing <laughs> and scrapping. You're too old for that act. How dare you speak to a captain like that? The fish. Huh? catch anything? I, uh, no, not yet. We... Are you guys even trying? Is it really that hard? There's good fish around here. I've never seen a dry spell such as this. Excuses, excuses. Just give me something fresh, okay? You've got a long voyage ahead. I knew I shouldn't have taken this job. This babysitting job, right? Palm's Tale, The Mage's Voyage. Prior Dias. Call for me, Elder. Where's Palum? I apologize, Elder. I'll go fetch him immediately. I'm right here. Palum, where have you been? What? Am I supposed to report every little detail of my life to you? So I believe it's supposed to be like... It's definitely over 10 years since the first part of the game. So what did you need, Elder? I received a request from a certain foreign nation. A request? Another prayer job from some country trying to palm its problems off on others, no doubt? I think they meant pawn. Pawn off their problems. Palum. I'll let you handle this one for them. By the way, Elder, have you made your decision yet? About the sage training you brought up? That's the one. You are still not ready yet, Palum. Still? When will you actually think I'm ready, Elder? Palum. Alright, alright. So what's this request, request about? This nation wishes us to send a mage in order to train their epipots. I would be happy to handle this request, Elder. Thank you, but I've decided to send Palum instead. Or this time. What? Isn't it normally Parum's job to train Epops? Elder? Maybe it's, I don't know how to pronounce that. It'll be your task this time, Palum. But what use would it be to send me? I don't know a thing about white magic. What use you would be depends entirely on you, Palum. So you want to be a sage, so you're supposed to be able to learn white magic too. Back 
in present time. We stayed there all this time, and it got dark. <laughs> Guess it's nighttime already. And just look at that moon. It's getting closer and closer. Nice. I'm going to try to finish this in about an hour. So that means no unnecessary uh, exploration. Elder, why did you send in Palm instead of me? Hmm. There are some things that only he is capable of, I believe. And what's more, yeah, I think he's trying to resign. I'm fine. Maybe Pelham will take his place, so he needs to, uh, sort of taking these, uh, different types of jobs so she can, he can grow, uh, gain experience. Good morning. Did you sleep well? Are we there yet? I'm afraid not. Why don't you take a walk around the deck? Though I'm sure you're sick of it by now. <laughs> Try this beautiful land blessed with clear water and lush forests. I believe a lot of lady friends. I saw a falling star in the northern skies, but I had a bad feeling about it. That's probably uh, talking about the thing that Yang and Ursula saw. Or mainly what Ursula saw. Apparently a large city fell under monster attack recently. Captain. Yes? <clears throat> I seem to remember you convincing me that the trip would take no more than a week. Yes. And how long has it been since we departed from Mesidia? About a month now, I suppose. Jeez. I don't think it'll take that long. I wonder if they even went into some port just to rest at a city. I guess there's nothing much I can say given that our compass is broken. Oh, that too. Might be just going who knows where. That is it, sir. But you're all supposed to be sailors, aren't you? More or less. And then shouldn't you have been able to do something to navigate us through this? I mean, come on. I'm sorry about this, my lord. <laughs> the look on his face is pretty interesting. Wait, up ahead, look. I'm not falling for <laughs> that again, Captain. No, really, there it is, the Cape of Troia. Somehow we made it. I don't think I remember that lighthouse. That's new. Troya Coast. I am so sorry that it took this long, my lord. Aren't we still quite a ways away from Troya? If you cross between the western bridge and go north from there, you'll find a forest of chocobos. You then cross the river on a chocobo and you arrive in Troy in no time. Fair enough. Please be careful, my lord. Is that all? I I am truly regretful for this delay. You don't have to kiss up to me like that. How old are you again? So sorry. <laughs> Jeez. Well, see you later. It's <laughs> <Just> like <laughs> raises his stub, because that's the way they are drawn. Farewell, my lord. Alright. So we supposed to fight this enemy, apparently. Supposed to find some uh, forest with chocobos. Or not. 
maybe I do have to. Maybe chop those bows are the only things I can uh, cross. Cross that river. Maybe it's the northwest, I don't remember. Chocobo Forest. I must be a blind. Maybe Elja here. I think we went to the castle, not uh, in that place. What? No, I'm just some old woman. Thank you very much. I happen to be the Chancellor of Troy, you know. How rude of you. Um, sorry. Thank you for coming to Troya. It must have been a long journey. That isn't the half of it. Yeah, you've been out there for a month, apparently. I'm sure you are aware of the reason why we have requested the Elder of Mesidia to send you here. A pop training, right? So who I'd be working with? It's one of you. It's like nope. There's another. I thought Troya had all eight pops position filled. One of our group has fallen ill, I'm afraid. The Ipops of Troya cannot fully carry out their role unless all eight of us serve as one. Uh, so basically you need a new Ipopton fast. Exactly. I see the talented mage of Mesidia has a very sharp mind indeed. So who will it be? Please enter Lenora. Bang. This looks like a summoner. The pop trainee of Troya, Leonora. Hmm. Yeah, this one is definitely in need of some training. <laughs> Way to uh, bust her bubbles. What? Did I offend you? No. Leonora arrived in Troy about eight years ago. She immediately showed interest in joining the Epops and has distinguished herself in service ever since. In recognition of her talents, we wanted to nominate her to the vacant position. All right, all right, enough introduction. If she was talent that talented, then why would she need a train uh, training in the first place? How can you say you have talent if you can't even become an Epops without someone drilling things into you? <laughs> Careful how, how you talk there, uh, Palum. Well, you see, besides, isn't it your job to train this girl? You, you are being rude. The pops are busy conducting their daily business, and and with one of their number fallen ill, there are only seven of them to serve their nation. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't mean need a manifesto. Jeez. <laughs> but are you sure I'm the man you want? And new pops' job is to serve a crystal, right? Wouldn't you want her to be trained in white magic instead? You've got the wrong person here if you expect me to know any white magic. What? You really should have sent Porum to handle this. No, no. It's alright. Eh? White magic or black magic both can provide me with the spiritual training I need. I'm sure the elder of Mercedes had a plan of his own in, his, in mind when he sent you. Looks like it. Then Lord Palum, 
We hereby request your company, Lenora, to the tri uh, Tower of Trials. The tower, tower of Trials? It lies south of here. If Lenora can reach its top floor, we will then uh, order or ordain her as an epop. It will be done. I look forward to training with you, Lord Pelham. Oh, yeah. Practice Lenora, join the party. I'm assuming she's a white mage. Alright, so. How oh, nice we are both high level. Yeah, I don't even know how long I'm gonna be able to stay up today. I'm very tired. Alright, so don't we need a chocobo to go back what? To back down. Oh, she knows both. <laughs> I think it's just keep her on defense though. Just let uh Pollen do all the work. If she had like an actual offensive magic, then I would use her whatever she had. Oh, can't use fire, use a blizzard. Save this whole time. Alright. Tower of Trials. Yeah, let's go straight for the top. No uh, treasure hunting. If I can help it. Pretty much if it like requires me to go all the way somewhere, then skip it. If it's just like, you know, just a very small path off to the side, then let's do it. This, er, uh, this is the tr Tower of Trials. What's on the top floor anyway? The, the mon what? monastic seal. Kind of like the, uh, Knight's Crest from, uh, Theodore's. Uh, tail. So you grab that, come back, and you're an epop? Yes. That sounds easy enough. Interesting though, yeah, I don't know how Porum would help her through. Oh, great Earth Crystal, who has blessed us with the great bounties of the land. For the clear water and lush forest, you have bequeathed us. Bequeathed? Bequeathed us? I offer you our thanks and our prayers. So, well, glad to see you can recite your prayers at least. <laughs> Jeez. Y yes, I, uh, are you ready to go, Lord Palom? You gonna tell her not to call him Lord either? Let's make something clear first. Yes. Could you knock it off with that Lord Palom junk? <laughs> but, I'm pretty sure we're the same age. I er I'm actually two years older than you. Damn. Oh yeah? Good for you, but don't expect me to start calling you Miss Leonora or anything. That's uh perfectly fine with me, Lord Pelham. I said <laughs> like I said, enough with the Lord. 
Y yes, Palum. That's better. Just call me Palum. That's who I is, am. Let's do this. Well, here we are. Yes. Ready to start with your training? Certainly. Please, tell me what I need to do. Let's begin with the basics. That will be fire. You know what fire is, right? What is it? <laughs> it's a fire attack. Ah, uh, yes, of course. <laughs> That's it? Whoa, wait, wait. What? That's it? Come on, Leonora. I thought they said you had talent. First thing you need with magic is the ability to project an image of the magic in question. That's part of the idea behind spell transcription, too. Clear your mind and create an image of pure fire. Then project it onto reality. Only I was like... Maybe we can do it in real life. No. It'd be horrible, actually. Wow, that's amazing. Again, because some people can't be trusted. Now you do it. Oh, what? This is what you'll be practicing on. Now, go on. Uh, okay. We're fire. Scorching red flames, burning brightly. The searing fire of a furnace. Oh. Learn... Sword fire? Yes. Learn fire. Nice. Okay, that's enough. So she did learn fire. Okay, not bad. Now let's see how well you do in real battle. A real battle? Training has no meaning if you can't do it in the real life situations, right? Can you maintain your composure and visualize that image with the monster staring you down? That's the key. Maintain your composure. Contain your monoposure. <laughs> ah. You've lost it already, haven't you? No, I can do it. Alright, let's do it. Ah. by himself. <laughs> it does like no damage. It's because she doesn't have intellect probably. She has a uh, spirit I'm pretty sure. And uh fire only does good if uh or black magic only does a lot of damage if you have a high intellect. And burst. Oh. <sighs> boss. Sort of. <gasps> A guardian, eh? Here, you try fighting this one by yourself. By myself? Yeah, by yourself. Now go on. Kick that little dude's ass. You have to get so close to it. fire for some reason. Yay. You did it! She learned fire all the way. Excellent. I, I did it! There's nothing to be that excited about. That's just one of the building blocks you can eventually upgrade into higher level magic. Higher level magic? Fire and then fire guy. The more powerful the spell, the more you'll need to concentrate your energy. I'll try. Of course, most people give up at this point, but. Oh, 
this way. Ooh, apart from a reason. Huh. Didn't think I'd see one of these here. Well, what's that? Take a look. Yeah, be restored. What is it? We make these are just regular people when we are out of mana or MP. I, I understand. I'll be careful about that. the bio. Excellent. Convenient one, Guardian per floor. We're up. <laughs> Me? Well, I'm not the one training here, am I? Am I? No, but. Good luck, kid. <laughs> Maybe I should have uh, taken a nap. Oh well. Push through. I have to do it twice. Oh, never mind. Mm -hmm. Let fire all the way. Yay, yeah, did it! I mean, hello. That was passable at best. Black magic is certainly harder to learn than white magic. Could you have to be offensive? to kill people. It's not a matter of difficulty. Most people are just better suited towards one or the other. That's why you get called a sage if you master both black and white magic. <gasps> Wait a minute. That isn't what you're training to become, is it? What? Oh, of course not. Never mind. Why those dreams? That's what I thought. Let's continue. Jeez. <laughs> But you already said yourself, Halloween, you gotta learn some white magic before you can call yourself a sage. Ten floors, huh? How about we tackle Blizzard next? You mean ice magic? Right. But don't think about ice. Think about the feeling of cold itself. Cold itself. Hmm. Cold air. Cold. 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 
You got the idea, even if you are scaring me a little. Cold. Cold. Learn Sword of Blizzard. Yes, cold. Gold, gold, gold. There, you're starting to get it. I think so. Well, that is seriously a creepy face you're making. It's like, how can you be creepy while you're cute? It's interesting. It's very subtle, I guess. Cute versus creepy. Blizzard does no damage. Yeah, really push through. This one too, right? Of course, now just get the creepy face of yours going. <laughs> Is there? <laughs> Not enough damage. Uh oh. Wow. Wow. I believe two should do it anyways. Wow. Seriously trying here? I'm sorry. I'm not looking for an apology or anything. I'll just try even harder from now on. So so teach me more, Palum, please. Can I ask you a question? 
Yes, what is it? And that pop shouldn't need to know black magic for her job. So why are you set on learning this stuff? I er uh, want to further my mind and spirit. Troy is a peaceful nation. Its epops aren't supposed to be fighting battles. But there's something weird going on in this land, you know. This ringing a bell for that for you at all? Don't want to talk about it, I see. Let's keep it over there. Next, thunder. Yep, let's get started. Thunder, rain clouds, lightning. Learns thunder. <laughs> I really like how they put the question mark, question mark next to it. It's like, I think this is thunder. Hopefully this is thunder. Okay, that's enough. You're certainly getting into the swing of things now. Some learn flare. <laughs> Thank you very much. Don't get too confident. This is usually the point where people let the eagle sink them. Er, yes, I understand. Mm -hmm. Healing staff. Oh, I have one. I did learn some of them, the band moves, but don't really need it right now, so I'll just refrain from using them. Alright, girl. Oh, hmm, boss fight coming up. Oh, we're going down. It's like black matches going down. Resistant to ice. Or uh, to fire, I mean. I feel like I walked in this room before.
Oh. They didn't all die. Already has another pot. Thunder girl, let's do it. Yep again. I won't let you down. Don't tell me. Show me. Okay. Prepare yourself, little dude. Little mage. something to run, but don't think that's the end of it. You've only just made it to the starting line. Yes, Palom. Yes, you only know some black magic moves. Black magic is all about knowing the properties of things, their weaknesses, and strengths. Which magic works best against what type of target? You need to have that knowledge drilled into you. Yes, it's all a matter of training, I suppose. That's right, and if you don't have a natural talent for it, you just have to work that much harder. Looks like the top floor. Wait, I thought there were 10 levels. Did I read that wrong? Yes, it is. Okay, it's been seven levels. Let's see here. The monastic seal is the very words etched on this flint. Now that's really stupid. So simply getting here isn't good enough? If that's all you need to do to be a Trojan Epopt, then you have to wonder what kind of... Stop it, please. You can say whatever you want to about wait to wait. <laughs> you can say whatever you want. Say whatever you want to about me. I don't care. But when it comes to the epops, I won't just stand here and let you insult them right in front of my face. So fight me! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> it's like fight me, Leonora. Runs away. I love how gentle and kind everyone in Troy has been to a stranger like me. Maybe he doesn't sound or seem like much to some magical prodigy like you, but... Oh, sorry. I wasn't trying to make fun of them. But listen, you're probably a lot better off without any natural talent. If you're a prodigy, then all that happens is you get lazy and quit pushing yourself to improve. Palum. I'm just saying, don't let yourself be satisfied with where you are now, okay? Anyways, let's head back. You got an epops post to fill. Okay.
Can we just teleport out? Is there anything in here? Oh. Oh, wait, did they miss the magic attack? Fire, oh well, they're all dead. That's all that matters. Oh man. To make you like target certain enemies, you have to target all of them. Damn, they're just like beating up on Minora here. Spirit, but uh, I did fire. Sandals. What about the other room? Is there nothing in there? I'm gonna say there's nothing in there, just leave. Otherwise, I'll be here forever. Interesting. I'm assuming she has no teleport, so it'd be nice if I can just teleport. Oh, I can. Let's get out of here then. See the suckers? So I suffer through this one, I can just get out. It's a chuckable forest here. Popped chamber. I return from the Tower of Trials. Ah, Lenora, you're back rather soon. And the monastic seal? Monastic seal? 
Yes, I touched the Tower of Stone plinth with my very hand. I'm never going to wash his hand ever again. Very good. I knew you had the right sort of potential within yourself. No, it was all thanks to Palin. Well, I should say so. If Porum were here instead of me, Luna would have come back here in a coffin. Oh, damn. Huh? What do you mean by that, Lord Palum? Why does the Tower of Charles have monsters and guardians and all that inside? Whoa. Why does Epops need black magic? Why does Troyan need it, for that matter? We Troyans need a way to protect ourselves. What are you saying? Your crystal might get swiped again? There's always a possibility of that. We have reports from across the globe about a certain kingdom engaging in suspicious behavior. Oh, which kingdom is that? Baron. You don't mean. Yes, we are speaking of Baron. What? You've got to be kidding me. It is unfortunately the truth, Lord Palum. That's ridiculous. Cecil never do anything like that. Runs away. Palum. Please excuse him. He must be tired from his long journey. It's my fault for giving him a great deal of trouble. Leonora. Well, I'm sure you are tired as well. Feel free to, to go. Take this time to rest your body. Yes, thank you. Like all these hip hops learned how uh, basic black magic. Palum, I'm sorry. You don't need to apologize for anything. But look, it may be true that the hip hops need a way to protect themselves in the crystal. But I refuse to believe what they said about Baron. Or Cecil. Are you alright? Perhaps you're just tired, pal. We should probably both get some rest. Yeah. Troyo Castle Infamary. Here, feel free to use the room as you like. <laughs> Man, what's that smell? This is the castle's infirmary. <laughs> this doesn't kind of smell like shit. Okay, that makes sense then. I guess you want to cure this filthy mouth of mine. <laughs> Troy Castle is usually off limits to men, so this is, was the only room I could find for you. You've got to be tired too by now. Get some rest already. All right. Um, I... Good night. <laughs> Snickers. <laughs> Runs. It's a very long time to watch her run. And thank you, Paolo. Continues to run. Oh, walks away this time. Is that it? Oh, <laughs> I thought I was it, but that's just Paolo. There was a time when Baron took away the crystals by force. No doubt about that. Sisa himself took the water crystal away from Missidia, no less. But that was all the work of Golbez in the end. And Golbez is gone. He went away with the moon. <gasps> the moon. The moon is back. Like I said, you live all your life like with the moon there. And then you just... I don't know. It's like 10 years though. So you should realize that the moon's back or something. The moon, that's it. I can't stay here anymore. What? 
Palm, what is it? Uh, I'm sorry if I woke you up. I, you might not believe me about this, but what is it? The crystal. It's afraid. I knew it. You felt it too, Palum? Yup. Where's the crystal? Beyond the Epops chamber. That's a weird word to say. Epops. Let's go. Oh, yeah, make me run there. Let me save. Oops. Side up here. Go for the crystal. Step aside. Uh oh. Cutscene usually means bad things. I brought Lord Palom with me. Lord Palom, I'm afraid I have some distressing news. A number of airships from Baron are approaching Troya as we speak. What? It seems clear that their objective is the Earth crystal we possess. So you want me to fight back against them? We are not asking that. We must wait to see what their next move is. Look, you underestimate what Baron could do. Let me keep the crystal for you. Palum? What are you going to do with the crystal? I'm not going to do anything with it. Do not engage Baron's soldiers, okay? Tell them some bandit stole the crystal or something. But... I'm going with you. You just get in my way. Sad. I'm an impopt who serves the Earth Crystal. I know I don't have much experience, but but still, I have a duty to fulfill. A duty to protect the crystal. You said it now. Very well, Leonora. We will entrust the crystal to you. I will make sure it is safe. <laughs> Runs in and grabs it. Earth Crystal. I will go get the crystal. I love how the crystal's like huge. Earth crystal obtained. We need to hurry. Get out of here. Stop, not that way. What? Gotta go back out the back, man. Oh, it's this lady. Girl. A serious girl. Where is the Earth Crystal? What purpose do you have for the Earth Crystal? Is there a reason why I must tell you? The Earth Crystal is a symbol of Troya itself. I'm afraid we cannot simply give it up to someone so easily. Is that what Sissel, the King of Baron, has in mind? I have no need to answer to an inferior species. Damn, cold. Inferior species? Are you trying to insult us? Uh-oh. I am not here to argue with you. Where is the crystal? We're too late. There's no place to run. To run. This way. I mean, technically you just teleport us out. But, it's a different story. Hidden passage? That pops you built this escape route in case anything like this ever happened. They thought of everything, didn't they? Alright. Troya Castle, second floor. I'm sure it won't be long before they find this passageway. Then we'll have to run as far as we can before that happens. So where's the path lead to? It runs underground to an exit near the castle entrance. Good, then let's keep moving until we get out. Dang it. <laughs> I knew this was a treasure room, but I just can't resist ice arrows. Cottage? I already have a bow and arrow. Or a bow, I mean. Oh, oh you. Hmm, things seem heating up around, don't they? Looking good. A 
even though I haven't really been getting items, but I'm just trying to finish this, finish this fight. Trail Castle Waterway. I see the item, but I'm gonna try my best not to grab it. I just want to skip everything and get out of here. Two items. I think that's the first time I've seen myself get two items after a battle. Which is silly, but. Okay. Rune Omelette. Gives intellect. Leonora leads some intellect. What are we getting out of here? Need some ice. You know, I probably would have been able to kill these enemies a lot easier if it wasn't a uh, waxing moon. Because <laughs> during the waxing moon, black magic is decreased by half, I believe. It's a uh, potency. So I just gotta wait for the next moon phase and I'll be good to go, probably. I think that middle one is gonna heal. Yep. That's okay. I think I'm going to use bio. This is annoying. I guess you should use Bile regardless. And I'm gonna run out of MP that way. Oh, speaking of running out of MP, it's a full heal thingy. Right. Let's see this easiest way out. Oh man, this thing is a maze. He's just down. I'm pretty sure the, to the right would have been a item of sorts. Oh, the bio killed it. That's nice. The sap killed it. Yay! Into the more intellect, the more damage. I do for magic. Remedy. Tent. Oh, that's some weird old lady. Oh, it's a good thing I haven't gotten silenced yet. There's a lot of items they're giving me though. Why are they giving me Bacchus wine? <clears throat> Berserk is probably the last thing I would like to happen. It's one of my mages. Yeah, okay, I'm glad they uh, revealed the map to me so I don't have to run around crazily looking for the way out. I use fire actually. Well, no matter what I used. Hmm. 
<laughs> I knew I should have went down here. Oh well. Oh wow. So like here you did there. Oh, ice did not work on him. Oh, retreat. Hey, get out of here. Get out of here. work. out right so it goes to show that um, exploration <laughs> causes uh, these games to take forever because when you're exploring then you have random encounters wherever you're going oh <laughs> girl better not and so it takes longer to play when you're exploring looks like they're still in the castle what about the A-Pops? They probably go dead. They are stupid, you know. I'm sure they won't do anything to escalate the situation. You respect them, don't you? Yes. So have faith in them. I will do that. Come on, we need to leave the castle. We out. I think that should be the end, right? Not quite. Well, I guess we're supposed to lose the crystal, right? Was it too soon? So where's a good place for us to, to run to? How about the Lodestone Cavern? We'll have a way to keep the pursuers at bay there. Where's that? This way. It lies northeast of Troya. The journey can be made by Black Chocobo from the northern reach of Chocobo Forest. Sounds like a plan. I'm actually going to take a very quick break. I'll be right back. Should be one more place I have to go, and then I should be done with this one. <laughs> I feel like I should really think, like, how much or how many like stages or dungeons that each story has. It's like about three, right? Two or three. But let's go ahead and get in here. Uh, let's heal. Because all these Chuckle Force always has a uh, 
white chocobo. Give us some MP back. Got this black chocobo. Let's go to the Lord's Dark Cat. At least it takes us directly there, so we don't have to. Uh... Oh no! That's them! There they are, after them! Can't <laughs> say so wait. Oh, they saw him flying away, that's why. <laughs> we are out. An airship from Baron. They found us, hang on. Ah, are those idiots actually trying to hit us? What are they thinking? Stone Cavern. So the original game, there was like a magnetic field in here. Thank you, Chocobo. You need to get out of here now. Quay. There was a magnetic field inside this cave the first time we went in here because of the dark elf. No, it's hiding in there. This way. He had stolen Troyo's crystal. Right. And so, uh, yeah, it was. They were hiding in here. Or he was like Dark Elf was hiding here, and he erected a magnetic field that rendered anyone who used anything metal paralyzed, more or less. Is back? Oh, that's some serious magnetic field. Any who draw near doning plate armor of plate and chain become unable to move. I see. So that is why soldiers were unable to move. Yes, that's the plan. Oh. Wait, did she erect it? I don't know. Well then, you have to start back to Troya. What? Look, things are getting serious here. This is nothing like your training before. I'm ready for whatever comes my way. Besides, you're going to need my white magic. It is true. Is there a written rule somewhere that says all white mages have to be so stubborn? What was that? Nothing. Just go for the gold. I really don't know where its weakness is. It's probably thunder. No? Oh well. Maybe it's just no weakness. It just looks like it's like a squid type enemy. Ah, oh, no intellect. That's fine. I wish there was like a weaker holy magic that she could cast instead. Like something I think called Dia? I don't know which Final Fantasy that's from, but it's definitely not in this one. It's definitely nostalgic coming back to these places. I'm assuming fire is actually its weakness. I guess they're technically demons. of the lowest back there, but or whatever it's called. There. Probably go to Leonore. She needs more intellect. That's big buff in intellect. It's very nice. Mm -hmm. 
Pretty sure there's a safe space in that other room that I just skipped. Oh. Oh. More fraud. Intellect. Give me all intellect, please. She's almost as strong as uh, Palomir. I think she's, do I just say like 36? This is deception put up by the epops. So where's the real path? This way. It's like, whoa, you walked on thin air. Aha. This is a fake route as well. And they really hit them more. It's okay. I knew it's. Oh. I knew it was a secret path here, but I was hoping it would take me to the other one too. Oh, that my player is green. Also resistant against fire. I think. Wait, what? I think I was just uh, had too much defense against magic, so she couldn't really do the damage she needed. There's another heal space or something. Somehow they're in here without being uh, weighed down by their things. There they are. Wow. Palum. They must have taken off their equipment. <laughs> sort of. Sitting here naked. Ah. Back tag. Nope. We out of here. I'm just gonna use flare and higher level magics. Another crystal chamber. Like fight. What? What? Think about it. How many soldiers are after us? We don't have infinite magic, you know. If they storm us with their superior numbers, we'll surely run out of energy sooner or later. We've got to face the facts. This is not like you. Huh? This is not like you at all! Now what could you possibly know about me? Magnetic field get taken away. Lenore, get back. 
Another crystal. Oh. Yes, my prison has been unlocked. The Dark Elf. I simply lost my body in the previous battle. Nothing more. But the crystal has given me a physical form once again. That horrifying noise is also gone. This time, I will finally acquire eternal life. Oh no. That's not good. How did we beat you last time? I don't remember. I think fire. Fire was his weakness. I don't have a level, uh, higher level stuff than that. Oh, you're just cheating now. Be quiet, bitch. Oh, that's not, a uh, super effective. I think I just gotta keep healing. This is gonna get to attack twice, right? Oh no. Uh... Oh dang, file is like instantly done. Particle bomb. Oh, not tornado. Uh oh. Living life on the edge here. Let's better kill him or I'm done. Oh. It's pretty cool actually. That's pretty neat. This form no longer suffices. Oh no. I'm not ready for this. Shit. Probably slow him too. I slow this one down, I mean. Uh oh. <sighs> it's not as bad as I was anticipating. No effect. Dang it. It's a waste. Kill myself again. Um, magic doesn't work. Uh oh. Scripted battles. Diamond dust. Shiva. Let's skip it. Oh. Oh. Hello, scripted. But I thought <laughs> we're about to get pwned. That is not the case. The noise is gone, and yet, where, where's my eternal life? Ah! You are defeated. Shiva, that must mean this is Rydia, but it is not Rydia. This mysterious lunar girl. Who are you? Give me the crystal. You are from Baron. Didn't you hear me? Give me the crystal. What happened to Cecil? I don't need to answer that. If you won't give it to me, I will take it by force. We'll see about that. For a specimen of an inferior species, you seem to have some measure of intellect, but you fail to realize the gap between your power and mine. Here, just take it. Give me the crystal and get out of here. 
I, I can't. I'm your teacher, right? You've got to listen to me. But... Don't worry about me. I've got the perfect plan. Really? Yeah, trust me. Now, Leonor, go! Oh, it teleported. Why don't you teleport all of us? Finally, ready to hand over the crystal? You said I was one of the inferior species, didn't you? Yes. Well, you're about to be outfoxed by someone of that species right before your eyes. What do you mean? I mean this. Break. Damn. This shit again? <laughs> it's not the first time he broke. Or break it. Apparently. Mm, Cause the thing is, the elder could do it in the last game. I'm pretty sure she could do it as well. Oh. Well, that's just me. This one's lasting a lot longer than I thought. So am I supposed to leave, or am I supposed to... Petrify yourself along with the crystal. What a fool. I'll just shatter your body and retrieve the crystal. Wait. <laughs> There's no point of her leaving if she's gonna come back. Don't you touch, Paolo. All we want is the crystal. I know that. It's not. You idiot, why'd you come back here? How could you do that? What if she shattered you to pieces? She was bluffing. You're the one who's bluffing here. You've always been that way. <laughs> True. What? So there I was on the slopes on Mount Ordeals when I cast an awesome blizzard in. Wow. Ow. How many times are you going to, to be late to training? The elder's really angry. Mm, so she's that girl. Interesting. Hee hee. Hee hee. That was you? You've been that way for as long as I've known you. Bluffing and talking big, just to make other feel better. Doesn't make sense though, but... I've had enough of this. Hand it over now. I think you misunderstood. You say anything about giving you this thing. Giving up your last chance to live, I find such a decision incomprehensible. Maybe so. You know, this girl here is no good as an epop. <laughs> but as my partner, she passes with flying colors. You learn the particle bomb band. Oh jeez, we actually gonna fight this? Gah. I'm gonna somehow heal Pollen before he gets blowed up. Where's my high potion? I wonder if we're supposed to just use Particle Bomb and be done. Level 3 Particle Bomb. It looks like the case, actually. It's probably futile, though. It's supposed to be, like, super overpowered. I'm pretty sure. Not enough cash, stranger. Let's 
get it. Nope, I'll watch it. Oh. Open levels up the more you use it. I wonder if she's actually gonna attack. She probably attack once she gets to a certain HP threshold. She might hit it to like meteor or something crazy. Do I have Osmos? I have to use it. No effect. Is that it? Summon Ifrit? Nope. More diamond does. That means we're done. I don't think she'll be do anything anyways. <laughs> yeah, it was futile, indeed. Nora. So I'm taking this. Lost the Earth Crystal. <laughs> that seems to be like the motif of this game. Just losing crystals. Wait, you can't. She's like, I already did. I'm done with you. No. No. Now ordeals tra trail. Trail. What the? Poor him? What? Power. Hmm, what question is why are you up here with Kane? Trying to remember when we saw Kane. But anyways. That's the end of Palum's tale.